Donald Trump says that he wants to build a wall on the border between the United States of America and Mexico. And that has been one of the most controversial comments that have played out throughout this campaign. I am at uh, a bar and a restaurant that's run by Mexicans. And I believe you guys are not very happy with the statements Donald Trump has made. Um, Jose Maria is the brand ambassador of this tequila brand. It's a Mexican company called Mezcal. And uh, this brand has been doing a lot of uh, anti-Trump campaign on social media and other places. Jose, what are your thoughts on what Trump has been saying as far as Mexico is concerned and Mexican people here? I think uh, we are not the only ones. I think there is a lot of uh, different brands trying to also show support about what's going on with uh, Donald Trump and all the things that he's saying. So Meteor is one of the brands and also there is a different brand, uh, Illegal Mezcal, and they also have like these campaigns about Donald Trump. And uh, a little bit more like on the defensive side, but so as well. What does it say? It says, uh, Donald Trump, eres un pendejo, which means uh, you are an asshole. It's really straightforward. So I guess the, the thing ab about what he's saying about Mexican people is uh, real offensive as well. It's not only with Mexican people, as well with Latinos and all kind of like uh, immigrants, when this country is based with, uh, you know, it's based for immigrants. So we're trying to support all the people, all the immigrants too, and trying to make this uh, kind of like a revolution against him and all these ideas that represent like really like bad ideas about this country and we don't want someone like him running the country as well because then we, you know, we are in risk of, to probably get deportation for a lot of the immigrant people, no? which is Right, so, you know, I mean, I understand what you're saying. You're saying that you do not support the idea that Donald Trump is representing and you think that's very anti-American. Uh, let me co uh, go, uh, come to you now, Carlitos. Carlitos, uh, Mezcal is doing one campaign, lots of other campaigns happening. I met South Asians, I met Chinese, and the view there is mixed. Of course, there are those who support uh, Clinton and there are those who support Trump. Have you met anybody uh, who comes from Mexico or, you know, their family is from Mexico who is supporting Donald Trump? I heard about them, but I actually haven't met any. So there are a few of those. Yeah, there's this one uh, guy, he's the uh, head of uh, Latinos for Trump. You heard about him. Uh, he's getting a lot of press. And he's tapped into the same ideology that um, because you're a billionaire, because you are, um, have this massive amount of resources, you can just go on and say whatever you want and get away with it. And that's, that's the danger in my mind. That's the real danger that because of the resources, people are starting to think that, well, he can say that, why can I? And that triggers this reaction that is, you can feel it. The energy in the air is, is different than it was. And so, but tell me, what sort of activities have you been involved in? Because there are also, uh, uh, right, uh, Jose, these t-shirts which uh, are sort of talking about how you're against Trump. I, I wear a hat that says uh, <laughs> Trump. Oh. Uh, it, are you familiar with uh, John Oliver? Yeah. So his show put up through uh, the HBO site. This hat that says Don, uh, Trump and make Donald Trump again. Um, today is the only day I actually oh, not wear it. Oh, that's we wear that all the time. Yeah, yeah. Every day, every day. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot of a lot of things like that. Yeah. And, uh, so, do you think where do you uh, think the vote of the Mexican American community is going to go? Uh, the vote situation. The vote. No, the vote situation. Um, well, I, I guess the the Latino vote is going to go a little bit more for Hillary because. Uh, the obvious reasons that Donald Trump is against all the immigrants as well. But uh, hopefully we'll win and also, even if uh, probably Donald Trump uh, wins, just if, if that's the case, we will you know, hope that probably he's going to try to do something different and probably what well, he was saying about deporting all these people yeah. is just going to be like words and we're actually going to do something different and something that is going to be more productive that only get rid of a you know, people, and that's it. No, what we need is more like a solution, and that's not really a solution at all. No. So these Mexican uh, gentlemen here say they find Donald Trump highly un-American, and they don't want the America they live in to be a Trump's America. This is just one of the brands that has gone uh, all out against Donald Trump. This is Anshul Bora with Nasim Khan in Brooklyn, in New York for real.